In this video, we're gonna compare and contrast male blue healers versus female blue healers. Blue healers, also known as the Australian cattle dog, are incredible dogs. They're intense, they're loving, loyal, friendly, and incredibly smart. So in this video, we'll find out if there's a difference between male and female blue healers. If you're new to our channel, welcome. We make dog videos that are educational and entertaining. And by the end of this video, you'll know the difference, if there is any, between a male and a female blue healer. Since blue healers are so intense, it's important to understand if a male blue healer is gonna be more intense, require more exercise, or if a female will be like that. We'll find all of that out here as we compare and contrast male versus female. Let's get it started with the first category. First, we'll compare and contrast male and female with their temperament. A blue healer is an intense dog with high energy requirements, a working class dog that's out herding animals, one that's not afraid to be out in the elements doing a lot of different jobs. First, we'll start with a male. A male is intense and they do require a lot of energy. They wanna be out there, they wanna do exactly what it is that you're doing, they wanna be with their owner, and they wanna have a job to do. So they're up for any job, any activity, as long as they're with their owner. Same goes for the female. The female is intense, and some people have even said females are a little more intense when it comes to just the overall protection level and the alertness level, because of that may be motherly instinct so both male and female blue healers are intense they know what's going on they're not aloof they're very alert they have high energy requirements and if you the owner can keep them exercised they'll be both happy healthy dogs and their temperament will chill out a little bit over time and you'll have a long happy life with your blue healer next we'll look at training differences Blue healers are incredibly smart and there's nothing that these guys can't do. First for the male, these guys wanna learn, they wanna know what they need to do, they want a job, they wanna keep their minds active. And same goes for the female. Both the male and female blue healers are incredibly smart and they have an intelligence level that's top three according to the AKC. So when you look to train your blue healer, whether they're male or female, you won't have a problem at all. And they're so smart that if you don't give them the exercise and you don't keep their mind busy, they'll find jobs on their own. And usually those jobs are not good. They're destructive, they escape. So if you keep your blue healer active, keep their mind active, both the male and female blue healers will be very happy with you for a long time to come. Next, we'll compare and contrast the size between a male blue healer and a female blue healer. Blue healers are considered medium-sized dog with the male being slightly larger. A male blue healer stands anywhere from 18 to 20 inches and they can weigh up to 50 pounds where a female blue healer is 17 to 18 inches tall and they can weigh up to 40 pounds. So they're typically 30 to 40 pounds where a male is going to be 35 to 50 pounds and they're gonna be slightly bigger on average, but it's not super noticeable and they are considered a medium sized dog throughout. So there's not different variations like a mini poodle or a large poodle. There's a one size and they're typically a medium sized dog that can do it all because of their robust strength and they're super smarts. Next we'll compare the exercise requirements between a male blue healer and a female blue healer. If you've watched any of our videos or you know anything about blue healers, it doesn't matter if they're male or female, these guys need exercise. They want it, they crave it. They're up for any adventure and they'll do just about anything, whether that's rock climbing, walking, herding, swimming. These guys are up for any adventure and they just want a job to do, they want to be active, they want to be outside. So whether you're getting a male or female or if you've owned a male or female, you know these guys are active and they need that exercise. If they don't get the exercise, they can bite or nip inside the home, they can be destructive inside the home and they'll tear up like you wouldn't believe. So they need two hours of vigorous activity every day. If you can give this to your blue healer, there'll be no problem at all and a dog that you'll love for a long time. In general, male and female blue healers are really quite similar, with a few slight differences in their size and temperament. But overall, these guys need exercise, and if they get that, they will be a great dog for you and your family for a long time to come. We hope you've enjoyed this video, and we'll see you on the next one.